Hey YouTube, today we're going to be doing an unboxing of Courtney, who is a recent American girl that was released. Her name, her full name is Courtney Moore, and I always had a thing for this decade. Like, I think a lot of people can relate to. Things were changing, but they weren't like, um, as dramatically weird as they are now. <laughs> and the economy was actually good, so, yay. <laughs> um, Courtney is supposed to be based in 1986. And that's a year before I was born, so that's really cool. And joining us today are actual dolls from the 80s, because I'm going to pretend that these were Courtney's. Um, so that'll be cute. I like it when dolls have dolls of their own. And um, so far, what I can tell, she's got really pretty facial features. So I'm going to debox her and show you what comes with her. Well, once again, American Girl has not steered me wrong. She is a very beautiful, very beautiful quality doll. Um, I'm in love with the color of her eyes because they're like a dark navy blue. She's wearing a two-piece shirt that says totally cool and a stonewashed jean skirt. And I literally had stuff like this growing up, especially this skirt. But mine were shorts, but I remember it clearly. <laughs> When I was a kid, I was like, what the hell is this? But, you know, parents have the final say in small children's clothing. But actually, it's really cute. So I wish I appreciated it more back then. Um, she's wearing leggings and little white boots. And she's very cute. The only thing I would say is her hair should be crimped, like this doll. Because this was more in style back then. But other than that, I think she's really cute. One of the things I was hoping to get was the orange lip smacker that I keep seeing um, in pictures. She has it on a necklace, but the issue with that is, I guess it's from one of her accessory packs, but the joke's on American Girl because I've got a thousand of these bad boys lying around, so <laughs> I'll just make my own necklace. Screw it. And I just, I love it. I think she's really, really cute. Her wig is very full and pretty. She kind of reminds me of my cousin, <laughs> who's two weeks younger than me. So there are pictures of us together and she kind of looks like her, you know. I guess because of the clothes too and everything. Just supposed to be mine of her in the hair. But um, the doll is so cute. And she even has one of those 80s scrunchies and I think, yep, a rubber band underneath. She's quite beautiful. Since I like her name, I'm going to keep it. Sometimes I change my American Girls, but um, this time I'm going to keep it because I like Courtney. And here's her book that comes with her, Courtney Changes the Game. I like that they come with little novels. Oh, and this is really detailed, wow. Very cute. I like that they come with little novels because it shows kids that it's not just all about playing, that you have to use your brain, and part of having an imagination to play also includes a highly intelligent mind. I <laughs> you can't be a dullard and play with your dolls because you're going to get bored easily. And that's a waste of time and money for everyone. Now, being that her accessory pack is expensive, whatever, I got her a Halloween costume, or a Halloween outfit, I guess you could say. This is handmade by a seller on eBay. And I think it's really cute. You see the pattern with the cats and the pumpkins? I also bought her two hair barrettes that were on sale at CBS because I thought that they were adorable and even if they're a little big that's okay and then I got her this shirt and anyone who is a fan of the 80s will know the zip remedy is part of a show that was amazing I think <laughs> called Degrassi Junior High and Degrassi High and three of the main characters these idiots here that's Wheels, Joey, and Snake had their own band and they called themselves the Zit Remedy. At first they were the Zits and then they became the Remedy. Okay. <laughs> so the year is a little different. It's 1989, she's 86, but whatever. I'm gonna cut it down to size. This is the smallest size that they had, was a child's extra small. So I'm gonna have to like shape it to her form <clears throat> and then I'm gonna like, you know, doctor it up. But I thought it was really funny and it definitely goes with the time period. So when I post pictures of it, I wonder how many people are going to be like, oh man, the zits! <laughs> because it all goes together. But anyway, <clears throat> I hope you guys 
enjoyed and let's sit Courtney with her new friends and I'm gonna have to change her name because her name was also Courtney when I got her but <laughs> um unless she named the doll after herself that they don't look like but anyway so here we go a whole bunch of cute 80s girls together Ooh, why are you always kicking off your shoe kid give me a second Okay, here they all are together, and they look ridiculously cute. I love it. And she mostly is reminiscent of that time, in my opinion. Even, like, the barrettes and stuff. It's hilarious. So, photo op, kids. Yay. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Enjoy your Wednesday.